Common Misconceptions About the Common Cold You catch a cold from being cold. Clarification, this is a widespread myth. While cold weather can stress the immune system, the common cold is caused by viruses, not temperature. Exposure to cold weather doesn't directly cause colds, rather, increased indoor activity during colder months can lead to higher transmission rates. You can catch a cold from being wet or having wet hair. Clarification, wetness does not cause colds. Like the previous point, colds are caused by viruses. While being cold or wet may make you feel uncomfortable, it does not increase your risk of infection. Antibiotics can treat the common cold. Clarification. Antibiotics are effective against bacterial infections, not viral infections like the cold. Taking antibiotics for a cold can lead to antibiotic resistance and other health issues without providing any benefit. You only get colds in the winter. Clarification While colds are more common in colder months, they can occur year-round. Viruses that cause colds can be prevalent any time of the year, especially in crowded places. Once you've had a cold, you're immune to it forever. Clarification there are over 200 viruses that cause cold symptoms, and immunity is often specific to the virus you were infected with. This means you can catch different strains of cold viruses multiple times throughout your life. Cold symptoms are always caused by a cold virus. Clarification Symptoms like a runny nose or cough can be caused by allergies, other viral infections, like the flu, or even irritants in the environment. Not every upper respiratory symptom is due to a cold virus. Drinking cold beverages makes your cold worse. Clarification: There is no scientific evidence that drinking cold drinks can worsen cold symptoms. Staying hydrated is key, and the temperature of the liquid does not impact recovery. You can sweat out a cold. You can sweat out a cold. Clarification. While rest and hydration are important for recovery, there's no medical evidence to support the idea that sweating can help expel the virus from your body. By addressing these misconceptions, you can help educate individuals on the reality of the common cold and its causes, promoting better understanding and prevention methods. Thank you for watching. We would love to hear your thoughts on narcotic plants in the comments below. If you're interested in learning more about medicinal plants and their applications, be sure to check out my other videos. Please like, share and subscribe.